And now to concerns about a new strain of COVID-19 where pink eye is a symptom and doctors say children are at a higher risk. Local 10's Cody Weddle is live in Miami with the details for us. Cody. And Nicole, thankfully, it appears this new strain is not causing more hospitalizations. But as you said there, it is producing a new symptom and it's parents of young kids who should be on the lookout. XBB.1.16, the newest variant of COVID-19 to ring alarm bells because doctors have reported an increase in one noticeable symptom. We have an increased risk of children having pink eye. It's itchy red eyes and a higher fever. FIU infectious disease professor Dr. Eileen Marty calls this new strain a descendant of the Omicron variant. Doctors have nicknamed it Arcturus and it appears to be spreading. Most likely it's not because of a change in how strong it is, but rather because there's less people that are fully vaccinated. On the ground, we checked in at Jackson Memorial Hospital to see if they're seeing cases of the new strain. The reports are anecdotal and um, we have not really seen an uptick in um, cases requiring um, hospitalization. We also checked in with Nicholas Children's Hospital. We, we do see some of the symptoms that are described with conjunctivitis, but those are more kind of outpatient. This, the advice to parents. If you're seeing symptoms of fever, uh, upper respiratory infections, not to send the kids to school with that, no matter what it is. Experts say the virus will continue to mutate and more strains develop as a method of survival and to evade immunity. And the CDC also announcing today that it will end tracking community spread of COVID-19. To track the virus now, they will rely on hospitalizations. That's already how they track other diseases like the flu. We're live in Miami tonight. I'm Cody Weddle, Local 10 News.